Ah, uh, welcome, welcome, welcome all to some more Mario Classic. After doing so much research about this game, its history, its origins, I finally realized what I was missing. Not only did I miss the secret exit, somewhere between World 3 and World 5, there, there's another one of those weird pipes that links them together. I'm not sure where it is. I know where, the, where one of the pipes is in World 5, but... I really don't care that much. But I realized I actually missed a secret exit in World 8, which was... Son of a bitch. This is not where I wanted to go. Let's get out of there. Th that world always confuses me a little bit. Now to go all the way back up there again. But as I was saying... Where I was... Uh, the place I was needing to go was actually deep within World 8. There, apparently in Wagma Way, there was actually a secret exit I missed, because I checked the map files for this game, and there's actually a... Uh, let's just go. Perfect. And there's actually uh, another world I missed, uh, which might actually have one of the best levels in this game, if Zephyr actually made it correctly. I only got to check its name, which is Flip Switch Blocks or something like that, but if he made it correctly, oh my god, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna have so much fucking fun. But as I slowly make my way over here, I guess I'll say this, um, I'm not gonna 100% this game, okay? I'm gonna beat all the levels, but I'm not gonna go through the extra effort of finding every bloody secret exit. As few as there are, I'm not gonna find them. Now to wag my way, I have to figure out where the secret exit is in this place. No idea where it could be, except that it could be somewhere. I can't eat dead people. Let's see what's over here. Since I don't really know what to expect from the secret exit in this place, I might as well get, you know, all the dirt and coins and all that. Since, why the hell not? I really hate that I have to actually look for the secret exit, too. I mean, wasn't it bad enough I needed eight stars? Wasn't it? Isn't it? I'll head to the right over here. Oh, thank god I can eat those. There was that, actually. These, like, switches. Let's see what's actually going on in there. Let's get back here. You poor excuse for a living creature. You should be living in a hole somewhere. But as you can probably tell, this video is probably going to go on for a while. You gotta be kidding me. Something is down there. I want to get down there. Oh, I lost everything! Damn it. Okay, Mr. Spider, how did you manage to make... a thread of web go inside lava? How the fuck did you do this? I mean, think about it, how did he get it inside the lava? Sure, you know, into the pits of hell. Even the pits of hell, or bottomless pits, have, you know, a bottom to it somewhere. But how did he, you know, make a thread in... in oh, I see, so I need... I need to figure out where this red switch is. Great. So I need to find a red switch before I can do... Pretty much anything. Great. I always hated having to find secret exits. Oh, there's the red switch. Now I have to figure out how to get back up. Now do you see why I don't like to look for secret exits? Because when 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 it's like actually mandatory, it can be kind of annoying. There's probably something up there actually. Hopefully a power up. So I could use one. Good. Can I... Nope. I don't know why I try to break Zephyr's games at this point. I'm sure he's done, like, a shit ton of testing to make sure even I can't break his game. 
Now to get down here... I must have timed this perfectly so that only that switch would work. I hope this is actually what I need, too. Because it would suck if it isn't. And it sucks. Well, at least I'm getting, like, some coins and all that. It's always nice to have some coinage around here. What the hell's going on over there? There's a pipe over there. I want to get over there, actually. But it seems this section's all nice and cleared out. There's nothing else down below. I haven't gone above yet. I should probably go back up there and see what the hell is going on. Well, at least I won that battle. Wait, I get another power-up? For what? What, Yoshi? That Yoshi wasn't even directly related to how I died. And I still blame it. Okay, so this is necessary just to get back up. Well, at least I got to the pipe. Still... Still unsure as to where I'm going. So fire's really good when it comes to hiding his shit. Especially when he hides a lot of other shit along with his first shit. Okay. Really? Come on, Yoshi. Really? We ain't got time for this. There we are. Come on, Yoshi! Being very difficult, you know. You know, if I die, I'm gonna be really pissed. Didn't I come over here already? Like, not, not in this game, in the past. Because I'm pretty sure I went through this spot in the past before. Okay, so coming above pretty much did nothing for me. I don't know what's in that block. Just another coin. Great. It's always just another coin. How about up there? Nope, just another coin. Really? Get back here. Stupid Yoshi. I wonder if the ace coins are actually what are gonna unlock the secret exit for me. I really doubt it, but can't hurt the check. I can't get back down below. I think I've already missed something. Can I can I go down there? Yeah, I've already missed something. Alright. Maybe I need to get over there with, uh, that switch, you know, activated. At least I could go backwards. Because if I couldn't, this, this whole, like, finding the secret exit deal would probably get annoying. I wonder if this level was actually designed specifically for this game, just to piss me off. Oh, right. I'm not even remotely close to where I wanted to check. There was a spot to the left that I wanted to check. There was a lot of lava in the ceiling. I was curious if I could do anything with it. Not that one. Wait, shit, that was the one I wanted to, to check. Damn it. This is why I don't search for secret exits. It takes me forever to find them. I mean, I would have already been done with this level had I been playing the way I like to play. <sighs> Whoa, Jesus. I don't think, you know, Yoshi could actually eat one of those. I figured, like, pure fire would, you know, not be within, you know, Yoshi's... Okay, yeah, I've already checked that one. 
Yeah, I already checked that one. So what am I missing? Because I need to get down there somehow. Oh, uh, maybe there's something to the left. Let's hope so. Yeah, there's some stuff over here. At least I got another one up, that's good. I still have no idea what I'm trying to accomplish here. I'm hitting all these switches, but I don't know what it does in the long run. Let's check above real quick. Let's not let's not even bother with all the stuff down below yet. I think that's the end. Yeah, that's the end to this section. I don't want to go there yet. I don't know a lot of things about this level yet, but I'm pretty sure I don't want to go there. Yep. Found the secret exit! Thank- I'm getting this goddamn Yoshi in here. I've worked quite hard with this Yoshi. It's coming with me. There we go. Damn it, I hate you and your secret exits. You at least could have said something in that level that there was a secret exit. But suspicious rocket ship. Ooh, I actually get to work for my uh, World 9. I thought I was just going to be transported there automatically. Detecting star power level... Set destination unknown, really. You misspelled unknown. Really? How are you supposed to know how to fly that thing? I'm not. That's the fun part about this. I'm not supposed to know how. Am I good yet? Hurry up and get this thing in the air? Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> wow. That was the slowest takeoff ever. Really? More Final Fantasy music? I guess in the next part we'll be taking on some more... This game! I can't wait to get into a 9-2. That's where I want to be so badly. But was that to beat you all idiot?